back in the Black Stars? Do you have interest in returning to the Black Stars in future? My second question is, you've been a big part of the of the building of this squad. It's 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 a new it's a new squad that that seems to have a good future. Having spent these months with them, how far can this team go? What do you think they can achieve together? First question about the decision. It's not only my hands. Um, before I started to work for the GFA, everybody knew, and I said it before, I have a contract with Dortmund, and I have to respect that. And um, I, even to come here what was very difficult, and the GFA put a lot of effort to release me. And at the end, they came by themselves to Dortmund to speak to, to the board. And at the end, they decided to release me for this task. What you have to know is the, the position I have as a talent coach is very, very crucial in Dortmund. We produce every year a lot of big, big talents and, and it's a very crucial and important position for the club. So normally they wouldn't want to let me go with it. But because I want to help the country and the GFA went there and had very, very good talks, they released me for six months. So it was, and I said it when I started, that I have a contract I could just sign for six months. This was the agreement between the GFA and Borussia Dortmund. It was not possible to, to do it longer. And um, they told me they wouldn't let me to go. But I talked to them that I, this is a once in a lifetime opportunity for me. So they let me go and we agreed on a six months term. So it will end now and it hasn't got anything to do with the outcome or results. It would have ended also if we would have been world champions. And I have to respect my contract. I have to respect the club I'm working for. And um, surely um, maybe one day I will get the, a chance to, to, to work again with the GFA. But the next two and a half years, I have a contract with Dortmund. I have to respect it.